so I am supposed to be getting a handbag today and it said the delivery time could be any time between 12 30 p.m and 3 and I knew oh I was like I'm gonna want to open this handbag as soon as it gets here and so I got fully ready so that you know I didn't open it before being able to show you guys because I want us to see it at the same time and I'm like, okay, it's 1.33, like I'm still waiting, I really wanted to get here. And my mom makes a joke and she goes, Won't you get here at 6 p.m.? And so I recheck my UPS app and it says it can get here as late as 7 p.m. So I am patiently, not patiently, I am in patiently waiting to see if this bag comes. But I just wanted to show you guys me right now while there's still some daylight just in case it does not come when the sun is up. <sighs> Guys, it has only been an hour since I did my little complaint and it has come. So I am so, so excited. Oh my gosh, the box is huge. Okay, um. So it is from Netta Porter. I hope that's how you say it. All of the UK luxury girls that I watch they shop here, so I am officially a part of the squad. This is the small Santa Croce bag from Dragon Diffusion in the color turquoise and it is better than expected. I actually wasn't going to get this color. This is the color that drew me to the bag, but I had no clue how this was going to work in my closet. But however, I was browsing and my little honey plug-in went off and this is not sponsored by honey. I just use that plug-in quite frequently and if you're interested in the honey plugin you should use my referral code I've never had anyone to refer to honey but if you don't know what it is it's a plugin and when you're shopping online it will offer coupons or sometimes cash back and what ended up happening is they offered me $75 cash back on this item so I was like okay this is my chance. Like I either have to get it in this shade or I have to get it in the light brown. And I was like, this is the shade that drew you to the bag. I'm not afraid of color. You guys know I'm not afraid of color. I have so many colorful bags. So I was like, this is my chance. This is the best price I'm gonna get it at. And it was also like an additional 10% off on the Netta Porter website. So I did that. And I know you're thinking like the bag is $380 on the Netta Porter website and on the actual um, Dragon Diffusion website, I believe it's $321. But once you add in shipping and all the extra fees, it ends up being $380 anyway. So I guess Netta Porter just includes that in their price that they show on the website. So I did get it for a great deal. I'm quite glad that I got it. The other shades I was interested in was a muted pink or this deep brown and I would definitely check out the other colors they have available on their website and I do think I'll get it in another shade. I think I want the larger size and the deep chocolate brown. We'll see if that happens in the future. Now I'm going to show you what fits in the bag by showing you my summer essentials. So let's start out with hygiene for some of my summer essentials. This is going to be the Kosas Sport Chemistry Deodorant. It has AHAs which help to provide an environment under your arms where bacteria cannot grow. And if you know a little bit about smell in your underarms that is caused by bacteria, and I'm someone that sweats 
a lot. Like I sweat even in the winter time just under my arms and this deodorant provides no smell. Like I put it on once and throughout the whole day I do not have to reapply it. And I'm also quite sensitive to aluminum and a lot of those ingredients in deodorant. Even the natural deodorants that are supposed to be baking soda based cause irritation and cause my underarms to be extremely dark. Like not even the natural slight discoloration that a lot of black women have, but excessively dark. So I love this because it keeps my underarms a healthy shade and fragrance free. <laughs> The next item is going to be this PFB Vanish. This is for your bikini line. If you know, you know, shaving, even waxing, any type of hair removal can cause irritation, discoloration, a lot of concerns around your bikini line. And this helps to chemically exfoliate that area safely and get rid of all those problems. And I have a very beautiful bikini line for summer. We are gonna move on to sunscreen. This is my black girl sunscreen. And yes, I am a black woman. And yes, I want to age gracefully. I don't want skin cancer. I would like to be beautiful, okay? So you need sunscreen. Everyone needs sunscreen. Do not play with the sunscreen. And that's just for my face, for my body. I just go ahead and use banana boat. I prefer a spray on sunscreen, but where I live, it gets to over 100 degrees. So I'm genuinely trying to take care of my body. Another thing about this bag, because it does have a suede lining, if you're putting things in there such as sunscreen, anything that's oily, your products throughout the summer, you could definitely just go ahead and put it in your dust bag and then put your dust bag in there. And this actually has really long straps, which you don't commonly see on dust bags for handbags. So I think it was meant for that purpose. It's actually really cute. I am going to very quickly bust through my makeup essentials. First things first, we have my Fenty Beauty Foundation. This is the Pro Filter Soft Matte Powder Foundation. Guys, I always thought that I couldn't wear foundation because liquid foundations would make me look so much older than my age. Nothing wrong with being older. I love when a woman ages gracefully, but you want to look your age. That's the whole point of aging gracefully. I don't wanna look more mature than I am. And a powder foundation is so much easier to use. Literally just rub it on. There's not so much to do, so much extra setting. It's great, it's easy. I recommend it to everyone everyone like I have normal to dry skin and I know that mainly women with oily skin prefer prefer <laughs> mainly women with oily skin prefer powder foundations but truly I believe this could work for anyone next on the list is going to be the Patrick Ta oh she's different powder and cream blush this does have both the powder and the cream and I love this blush because I don't wear foundation every day. So if I'm not wearing foundation, just being able to dip my finger in, rub the cream on my cheeks throughout the day is great. And when I am wearing foundation, I have the powder side. So it's a two-in-one, it's so beautiful. I remember I tried to buy this in a deeper shade and I went into Sephora and I totally thought I was getting a darker shade. And I ended up buying the same color, so. Ooh, excuse me, this is really the color that works best for me. Finally, into my lip products, we are doing the Bobbi Brown Crushed Liquid Lip. This is in the shade Smoothie Move. She's moving. But this is so gorgeous. It's on my lips right now. Do, 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 do. <laughs> I love this. It is a liquid lip, but it does not dry down matte. I remember the days when liquid lipsticks were like not moving. They would crack before they would move and come off your lips. I don't like that. I love all of my makeup to be quite hydrating and comfortable on my skin, on my lips. And the next thing is just gonna be Aquaphor, basic old Aquaphor. I use this as a chapstick because I don't have to reapply it a ton of times throughout the day. Really, it's like I have to reapply it once in the morning and right after I eat if I've been drinking a ton of water. And that's it. Like other chapsticks, I would have to reapply over and over and over again. And that is so annoying. Like 
I just want my lips to be moisturized, do what they need to do. And this doesn't dry your lips out farther. There's a lot of chapsticks that are playing games with you that are actually making your lips crustier. This does not do that. <laughs> we are moving into my final three items. That is going to be my Hydro Flask. I'm gonna see if I can actually fit it in this bag, but full disclosure, I never put my Hydro Flask in my bag. With all the water, it's so heavy. I just, no. And then my visors, all of these are from Calvin Klein, actually. You can get a visor from anywhere. It's just, when I'm doing my hair, I don't want anything messing it up. And a lot of times, I can't even wear a normal hat. When you got the big fro, the puff, it's not gonna go on. And I'm the kind of girl where it's like, I'm gonna dress up, but if I don't, as long as my hair is done, I feel cute. And in the summer times, oftentimes I'm not wearing the most over the top, super done up clothing. It's like, I'll throw on a t-shirt and some shorts, head to the beach, no makeup, no nothing. And so I need my hair to stay fresh. And a visor allows for that. So I'm gonna fit one of these into my bag. And the final piece is going to be these Zara sandals. You've seen these probably in almost every video I film now. That's how much I wear these. These are quite similar to the suede Birkenstock Arizonas. Get some. That's all I gotta say, get some. You can take them anywhere. The suede, yes, it gets dirty. Yes, it gets sweaty, but it just becomes more beautiful and worn in. And I love me some suede. Y'all know I love me some suede. So this bag actually did fit my Hydro Flask quite comfortably. There is still a little smidgen of space in there. So it's small, but it's mighty, okay? I would definitely get, I may not even need to get a different color in the bigger size because that's crazy. I have a trip coming up. So I'm gonna show you guys how to style this. I'm looking forward to it. Let me know if you're interested in this bag, if there's anything I left out. And please, please, please don't forget that if you do use the Honey plugin, go ahead, use my referral code. I'm gonna leave it in the description box. Please like and subscribe. And until next time.